Hey, good afternoon. I wanted to touch briefly with y'all today about estate planning. And I know um, I probably sound like some of you who have tuned in before that I'm beating a dead horse, but you gotta get it, you gotta get your estate plan in order. And as a person who likes to be in the courtroom, I like to be in the thick of the fight. There's one fight I never wanna be in, and that is when we're fighting over grandpa's money, when we're fighting over grandma's money. And the reason why is because those fights are so contentious and so bitter. And, you know, you have a faction of the family that believes that they are protecting the inheritance from vultures. And then there's another faction of the family that, that feels that, that they're doing exactly that. And the, the point of it is, is that an estate plan is a roadmap for the people you love the most. So they know what to do when you're not around. And I don't care who you get to do it. But, but have an estate plan because without an estate plan, you're left uh, asking the court for dependent administration, uh, which means you have to have permission to do anything and everything. The estate plan is, is a basic roadmap and, and it can be as, as complicated as you need it. And if, you, if you've got assets over $500,000, maybe you need that, maybe you need that living trust. But at a minimum, you need powers of attorney to, you know, so that way you don't have to have a guardian appointed if you become ill, if you have a stroke, uh, temporarily disabled, hit in a bad car wreck. You need to have somebody who's competent and qualified that you trust and love to make financial decisions for you, healthcare decisions for you. Because the alternative to that is when there's not these roadmaps in place, when these documents are not done, the alternative to that is litigation. It's down at the courthouse. It can get nasty. Hey, I'm the best. You know, daddy would want me to be making decisions about him. You know, you need to avoid that fight. And more importantly, the, the, how those attorneys who are appointed by the courts to determine guardianships and this, that, and the other, it, they're appointed by the court. So guess who pays them? The estate pays them. So the estate gets drained because there is no plan or can be subject to that risk. So get a plan in place. It, it, I can't stress it enough. Get your documents in order. Get your life planning documents in order. Your powers of attorney, basic will. If you have a complicated estate, get a trust in order and start make make your bank accounts payable on death so they avoid probate. There's all kinds of ways that you can prepare your family for the time that you may not be there for them. And I encourage you to do that. Anyway, have a wonderful day. Stay dry and safe out there.